Um, good morning, everyone. I will talk about learning deep representations of fine-grained visual descriptions. My name is Zeynep Akata, and this is a joint work with Scott Reed, Hong Lak Lee, and Bernd Schiele. We are interested in zero-shot learning problem where there is no labeled data available for some classes during training. For this, we need site information. Typically, these are per class attributes or word to vec embeddings. And uh, the framework is as follows. We embed images in an image feature space and classes in a class embedding space. And then we find the compatibility between these two spaces. Attributes um, are useful for this task, but they don't provide a natural language interface for the model. So we propose to use fine-grained visual descriptions as site information. When we look at the existing data sets that are available, uh, that includes bird images, for example, the sentences that come with them are not very detailed, so we may not be able to use them for classification. Therefore, we decided to be, uh, collect our own uh, sentences that correspond to the images in the Caltech UCSD birds dataset and Oxford flowers dataset. These are very detailed sentences. Ten sentences per image annotated using Amazon Mechanical Turk. After collecting the sentences, the next step is to use nature language embeddings and for that uh, there are several methods. We started with temporal CNNs that, are, that, that start with uh, uh, characters and then uh, there are 1D convolutions so this is very efficient. Another method is LSTM that uses recurrent neural network so it encodes the uh, sequence of the words in the sentence. Our proposal in this work is to combine the two and uh, so we stacked an RNN on top of a mid-level temporal CNN that is very efficient and also it encodes the sequence. The zero-shot learning accuracy in Caltech Birds dataset is shown in this uh, plot. The reference number is attributes, that's the state of the art. Temporal CNN that operates on characters already gives good results, but they don't reach the attributes. Uh, our method character level CNN RNN uh, is the pink line that uh, performs much better than TCNN. Uh, on the other hand, for in, in the word level, LSTMs are better than attributes and our word level CNN RNN improves over attributes and improves over any other method. So we say that fine-grained visual descriptions actually improve over expert annotated attributes. Sentences also open up applications for uh, different applications such as image retrieval. We have uh, queries as sentences and these are the highest ranked retrieved results. They are all, um, they all match the query basically. There are other um, applications that we can perform using sentences. For example, text to image generation. This work has been uh, presented last week in ICML. Uh, so using our sentences, these are the generated images. These are, um, these are very um, descriptive of the query actually, so it's encouraging. Um, this is all, so please come and see our poster number six for more details. Thank you.